graph and getting people to let them know that something is happening about your show. And other times it's more crafted and more <coughs> specific to users through sponsored stories and newsfeed, whether it be on desktop or mobile. Yeah. Um, so, you know, I don't think there's, uh, you know, any one way we think about it. We're not going in there with our head down, horns out, you know, spend money. Um, we actually take a little bit more strategic approach and, you know, try to cater to um, the need. And sometimes that's all about creative and content. And, you know, sometimes we layer in media. So I think it's uh, about paid, owned, and earned. And, you know, hitting the right person at the right time with the right strategy. And, you know, media is important. Yeah. Yeah. You know, with the, the folks in coincident viewing, a lot of this is obviously happening on, on tablets, right? So talk about mobile. You know, how is mobile fitting into the mix within your advertisers? You know, are you seeing the shift and kind of where, where are we with that now? Yeah. Um, you know, I joined the company two years ago, and we were a very desktop-centric company. And then, you know, Mark one day says, we're a mobile company. And then we're like, okay. And now we've shifted. And everything that we do, whether it's through our technology or um, the way that we um, work with marketers, um, is thinking about mobile first. And, you know, we have a joke that, you know, the new rule of thumb is how people scroll. Um, with their phones, and the importance of creating compelling content is never going to be more of a premium um, to get people to get them to stop, to get them to, to engage. So, um, you know, our recommendation to anyone is that think mobile first. Whether it's you're building an application and you want to get people to, you know, enter your front door that way, or whether it's using our native tools, you know, how is that content going to display um, on the phone, and what is the experience once someone ch decides to click? Um, to consume it, like, comment, or share upon it. So mobile, you know, absolutely should be part of your strategy and you should be thinking that way first. Yep. And with mobile, with mobile advertising, it seems like one of the most common criticisms you hear is, you know, you can't measure the ROI, there's no ROI, even sometimes when it comes to Facebook. And so I guess, what, what, are, what are you guys doing to kind of help advertisers better measure the ROI of the ad spend on Facebook? Kind of, where are you in that whole evolution? Um, it's a great question. Um, I think that you know anyone sitting in the seat from any platform um, would um, you know hope that we would have better tools and better analytics. I think it's a really hard question to answer. I can't get into too deep because we're in a quiet period, but I can say that you know every day we're out there trying to work more closely with our partners, um, you know, with third parties to kind of figure out you know what's the return on that investment. Um, and so, you know, it's, it's, it's a fun question to tackle. It's a fun problem right. to tackle um, and not an easy one. So we're trying every day. Yeah. Moving beyond the likes. Yes. dollars for the like. That's correct. Yeah. You have another uh, slide? Um, I do. Um, so 